What's going on, everybody? You got the Raging Rob here. I'm in I'm in Gross Teat, Gross Teat, Louisiana. The famous uh, Tiger Truck Stop. I think that's what it is. I don't know if the tiger's back here or not. Oh my God, he died. Rest in peace, Tony. What? He died? No shit. That's too bad, huh? Oh, he died. There's a camel back there. Tony died. Son of a bitch. Live camel, now they got... That sucks. died basically what happened was uh, this is the tiger truck stop in uh, Gross Teat, Louisiana I-10 exit 139 basically they held they had a tiger in a cage for years and years and there's like many celebrities that got involved trying to get them released uh, Leonardo DiCaprio got involved trying to get him released uh, P. Duck tried to get him released. I didn't know he died. What a sad ending, you know. And he didn't even have a life to, you know, enjoy. Locked in a cage all the time. That's what they did to him, you know. A few years ago, I got into a big uh, Facebook fight with this guy with the owner of this truck stop. A few years ago, I think it was like three years ago. I got into a big fight on Facebook with this, the owner of this truck stop over uh, him caging that tiger. You know, I got a hold of PETA and I did my work trying to, you know, get attention bringing to it, you know, to get him released. But now I just found out he died. I didn't know he died. I came back here. I came here to expose the what was happening. I mean, you see those cages. That's what, since he was a baby and his whole life, he was in those cages. and. A lot of animal rights groups and PETA tried, you know, they got involved trying to uh, get him released. And uh, I just found I, they had a rest in peace sign on a cage there. I didn't know he passed away. I just came by to see the tiger to, you know, give this scumbag who owns his truck stop some exposure. What a sad ending. What a, what a you know, this guy, what a, what a scumbag. The, the owner of this truck stop, I hope he... I don't know how he sleeps at night knowing that this tiger did not even have a life. Locked in a cage his whole fucking life. And now he's got camels and something else back there. I mean, Jesus Christ. This this truck stop has gained national attention. I think it's even gained international attention, if I'm not mistaken. Leonardo DiCaprio, he tried to get involved with uh, trying to get this tiger released. To no avail. I mean, the guy is a scumbag. So, this is Gross Teat, Louisiana, I-10, exit 139. So, rest in peace, Tony. Trust me, he's better off where he's at right now in uh, Tiger Heaven or whatever. He's better off away from this scumbag. Now he can roam free. Rest in peace, Tony. Tony, if you see this, too bad we couldn't help you down here. I apologize. We all apologize. I did my part. Uh, the first time I was at this truck stop, 2015, I did a YouTube video. I'll now delete a YouTube channel. So I did, and I got a hold of some groups and, you know, did my part trying to get them released to no avail. So I did my part. But anyway, Tony, if you see this, God rest your soul. You're in a better place away from this piece of shit. So, anyway, that's it.